Today we're looking at this 1988 GMC Sonoma. It should be the same, if not very similar, to the same era S10. This one should be from 1985 to 1993, or very similar to. Making sure the timing light works, my power and ground is on properly, I'm connected to number one cylinder right, everything looks good. So then come around here, in the cab on this diagnostic link connector, you need to jump terminals A and B. When you do so, the service engine light should flash. On this truck, it was actually broke. That's why they failed smog. Come back over here. I didn't get a too good of a view of the uh, timing indicator on the engine side. The light was a little bit bright. You do have one notch on the crank pulley. That notch will be the TDC mark for the crank. Timing it is supposed to be at 8 degrees on this vehicle. Acceptable by the state is plus or minus 3 degrees. I'm using my timing gun right here to advance the timing to 8. That should bring the notch on the pulley to 0 on the indicator. In this case it did. So without moving the timing with my gun, it lined up with number 8 on the indicator. Move the gun to 8 and it goes to 0, just to confirm. If you needed to adjust the timing, right down here is the distributor. There is the anchor bolt right there to the left of the distributor, right above the starter right here. The cylinder part right there is the starter. And right there is the bolt that you would loosen up. Snug, loose I should say, so that it doesn't let the distributor spin freely. That's pretty much it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you in the next video.